this. And there we saw the giants, the sons of Anak, which come on the giants. Listen to this, watch this. And this is in the Bible. And we were in our own sight as grasshoppers. Now watch this. And so we were in their sight. We were grasshopper in our own sight. And because that's how we saw ourselves, that's how everybody else is going to see us. Exactly right. Right. See, everybody, it's all in your mindset. Yes. You can't go around with a defeated mindset and expect to walk in victory. Right. You got to thank God for the victory, even though it don't look like victory going to show up. Right. It does matter how you look at yourself. Yes, it does. Amen. For those of us who... who who, who, you know, who work or have jobs or had a job, they oftentimes ask this question, why, why should I hire you? What, what, what's the, what's, what are we going to benefit from bringing you on the team? Now, you can't be answering that kind of question of, uh, well, um, <laughs> uh, no, to the interviewer, they already know, no, we can't have you. <laughs> you don't even know what you're... Your, your characteristic, you don't even know what you're going to add. No, we can't add. No, 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 no. But if you come with confidence, man, I'm going to bring integrity. I'm going to bring hard work. I know how to unite people, my, my strength. And then you just start listing it off, listing it off. A lot of, now, church people are going to say, man, that's so, you, you got to be humble. No, 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 no. When the interview says, why should we add you to the team? You better have something to say. Right. The Bible says, if you see yourself as a grasshopper, everybody else is going to see you as a grasshopper. That's right. Y'all remember that uh, the series Kung Fu? Yes. No, some of y'all, no, our yeah. this generation don't know nothing about that. Grasshopper. Yeah. Kids are like, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> How you see yourself is how everybody else is going to perceive you. Man, they came back with the report. He said, no. Look at all these giants. But then Caleb comes by. No, 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 no. Let's go right now. We can possess it right now. That's right. I ain't going to wait for somebody else to do what they do. I'm ready to be great right now. I want to encourage us. Be proactive. Yeah. Be proactive. Yeah. Don't be reactive. You know, reactive Christians, they wait for tragedy and trouble to strike before they start to go after God. That's being reactive. And as long as you are reactive, that means your life is dependent upon what somebody else does before you do something. That's right. But when you are proactive, that means whether somebody is looking or not, even if you do it by yourself, you're going to do it by yourself. Right. That's being proactive. Be proactive. Even if I go to the 24-hour fitness, if I'm by myself, I'm going to work out. That's it. Not long, but I'm going to work out. <laughs> How you see yourself does matter. 